This is an aerial yoga short sequence to open up the hips and work on your hip mobility. So we're gonna be using the hammock really low around your knee height and then starting in the cross position. To check your height, once you're in the cross position and your hips are in the center, your hips or your sit bones should barely be able to touch the mat. Then get some stability and extend one leg up and cross it over the other. I have my right crossed over my left. My right foot is nice and active and I'm just sinking into this stretch in the hips. If you would like to make it deeper, you can try pushing the knee away from you as you pull that foot towards you. Continue to think about drawing the shoulders down to elongate the spine and keeping the breath through the nose. Now for some mobility. If you have your right crossed over your right, slowly reach your right knee over to the right for a mild little twist. Letting your right knee come down to the floor as much as you feel comfortable. And if you would like to, you can interlace the fingers behind the head and lay back for a deeper opening into the spine and side body, maybe even a little reach side to side. Now activate the core, push down in your rooted foot to switch over to the other side. So now my right knee is turning over to the left and my left foot I'm rolling over onto the outside of it. Again, only letting the knees come down as far as it feels com comfortable. And then if you would like to get a deeper elongated stretch, letting yourself lay back or have a gentle reach side to side. As we exit, activate the core, bring those hips up, bringing ourselves back to neutral. And then we're gonna hug that right knee into the chest for wind removing. So draw the hips up and then you're going to bring the right knee into your chest. As you hug it in, draw the knee to the nose and actively draw your shoulders down, root down in that left foot to keep the hips up. All right, now let's switch. So now we're gonna cross the left over the right leg, keeping the left foot active and flexed and letting the hips sink down as much as we feel comfortable. And then we're going to turn over to the left and again, allowing yourself to go down as far as you feel comfortable and keeping the breath through the nose. And you might notice that one side feels a lot different than another side. And this is just something good to notice as imbalances in our strength and flexibility can cause pain and inefficiencies. All right, I like to gently reach side to side, just really kind of explore the sensations of the body and put breath into where I feel that I need to relax. As I'm exiting, activate the core, really root down into that standing foot to get the hips up so we can safely exit back to the center. And then we're going to counter pose with that knee hugging in towards the nose. Um, right here, I'm getting a little bit deeper stretch uh, before I go to this counter pose of wind removing. Hugging the knee in, knee to nose, shoulders down, belly breath. All right. So coming into easy pose to release coming out of the hammock.